what does it mean to you and what does it look like in that you know in like an, an ascended human state you know because even the the word ascension really for the most part was really coined by the bible and the story of jesus you know moving into this ascended like light body state of state of being state of consciousness so is that reflected in your understanding or, or what does ascension mean to you it's pretty simple for me. There's no, there's no final stage that you get to. I don't see ascension as like, oh, I've made it, um, mm. right? I don't see ascension like that. It's, a, it's, a, it's just a, it's, it's a journey. It's an experience. It's a process of moving from one state of consciousness to another, to another, to another, to another, like you're going up a, an elevator, right? And you're just, you're bo it's your body. So it's not you. You are already a higher state of consciousness. You're already higher consciousness. So it's not actually you that's ascending. It's a physical body that is ascending and taking you into higher states of consciousness. So you as a higher consciousness get to experience lower states of consciousness from than you, but higher states of consciousness in every now, if that makes sense. So you drop in as a higher consciousness, you're in a physicality that's very dense and ascension is the body continuing to hold higher frequencies allowing you the higher consciousness to be higher states of consciousness evolve on some sort of physical field in order to be higher states of consciousness so you have access to more you get to tap into more things you get to all while you are in sort of physicality for quite some time like are will we eventually ascend into light bodies perhaps perhaps not, right? Is a 5D physical body very different than this body? Absolutely. But is it still form? Absolutely. Um, time frame? Who knows when that like, you know, people like to call it like 5D, whatever, consciousness field, whatever that is, who knows when that will happen. But ascension to me is literally like, I'm just walking upstairs. Like I'm just, I'm just shifting frequencies. And, and that's it. And I have, there's no destination. You know, when you have a destination, you're going to suffer. I got to get there. I got to get there. I got to get there. Where are you going? Right. Why are you going anywhere? You just be in the now, let your body continually move you into higher states of consciousness. Cause this is all just a game, right? This is all just an illusion. This is all just you as a higher consciousness playing in this. And it's allowing you to experience different states of consciousness in physicality and so ascension is just that it's just it's collectively and individually moving from one frequency to the next frequency to the next frequency to the next frequency energetically mm -hmm. that's how i see it and it's and the more you are kind of aware of this by feeling it's all feeling it's all energy so you have to feel it the more you kind of start to really tap into what's happening to you on an energetic level you'll start to feel yourself shift you'll recognize things, you'll notice things, you'll feel differently, your triggers won't be the same, your relationships won't, you know, everything starts to change and shift because your frequency is shifting in your body. And so your resonance is shifting, your energetic field, you know, it starts to shift. You don't feel the same towards things. You don't do the same things. You don't say the same things. Things just start to shift. That's ascension. Beautiful. That's how I see it. Yeah. 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 Amazing.